betrayed. Jesus took the bread and he said, this bread is my body broken for you. So we come to this communion table, we bring the brokenness in our lives. The brokenness in the lives of those we love. And the brokenness of the world. And know that God wants healing and love, unconditional love. In ourselves and in all his creation. This is the table where we remember the cross. The cross that we are to take up. The cross of reconciliation. The cross of Christ. This cross is not something we bear or pain. It is an a joyful acceptance of the gospel to take it into our places of living. And so as we break bread together and we serve one another, may God please be with you as you serve those around you, thinking how much you are loved and you love them in Jesus. We have to So oh, on that night, Jesus also took the cup, saying, This cup is the cup of the new covenant sealed by my blood for the forgiveness of sins. And so we share this cup as we serve one another again. Remember, you are a priest, a minister of reconciliation as you serve your neighbor. The cup of healing, forgiveness, and new life.
Poets, we prepare to take this cup you prepare us. This table in the presence of our enemies may indeed all the enemies that keep us from walking more closely with our Lord and Savior be banished to the darkness. And the light of Christ's love fill our hearts with new passion for all he gives us. In Christ we see God's love. And he is with us and within us always. May God bless as we share this cup of the new covenant, sealed by his blood. In Jesus' name, drink ye of this. And we know that, I'm uh, sure that they sang the hymn before they went out from the up and road. So I invite us to sing our final hymn, Lord, dismiss us with our blessing. <laughs> <laughs> 